Welcome, I'm Joshi, and in this playthrough of Marvel Champions, we have Hulk, hang on a second, we have She-Hulk versus Rhino in standard difficulty. Uh, so on one of my recent videos, uh, someone commented, I think it was Danny Penn from memory, uh, if I would also play She-Hulk, and I thought, you know what, Hulk's through most of the villains at this point, always play about halfway or so, um, why not change it up with another Hulk, it's still on theme for me. Even though I do not play She-Hulk nearly as much as I do Hulk, um, it's still a Hulk. So why not? Let's uh, let's start her uh, adventure in the Hulk verse versus every villain. So starting off where I love to start off, we have Rhino, my favorite, my favorite punching bag. Uh, let's go through his very simple setup. So advance to stage one B. Threats out at seven. Comes in with nothing. Rhino schemes for one and attacks for two. Nothing particularly fancy or anything about him. He's just straightforward. Let's get straight into it. Move my mouse out of the way. And let's uh, drop a hand size of six. So we have strength, smash the problem, one, two punch, mockingbird, smash the problem, and genius. So we're doing aggression build. We're doing good old, you know, typical Hulk stuff. We just want to smash. Um, we don't need to smash the problem. We might hold on to. Yeah, we'll hold on to these. Hold on to those four, draw two more cards. We have an Avengers Mansion and a Gamma Slam. Oh, all right. I'm actually going to spend four resources to put in the Avengers Mansion. We'll exhaust that. Draw a card. Just a quick strike. We'll flip up to She-Hulk, we'll do the ability I love so much, do you even lift? I have to change this form, deal 2 damage to enemy, so we'll deal 2 to Rhino. Take him down to 12. We'll then spend 3 resources to bring in Mockingbird. After she enters place, stun an enemy. So we'll stun Rhino. She'll attack for 1. And take a Consequential. She-Hulk will attack for three. Taking Ryan down to eight. And we're ready up. Get four cards. That's what I expect from Hulks. Uh, we have Aggression, Power of Aggression, Helicarrier, Dropkick, and Legal Practice. All right, we get one threat on the main scheme. Rhino would go to attack us, but he's stunned. Get our encounter card. The villain attacks us. So tax for two plus one is three. All right, we'll use Avengers Mansion to draw a card. Is Nick Fury? Hmm. Wait, why did I? I should be at one, right? I must have put it up the wrong way. Uh, we will. See, now I'm reconsidering. I kind of want to drop kick and everything, but I don't think it makes sense. I've got Nick Fury in hand now. So we're going to spend four resources. Bring in Nick. He'll draw me three cards. With energy. Hellcat. And a one-two punch. We'll spend three and bring Hellcat in. So Mockingbird will thwart for one. Nick will attack for two. Hellcat will attack for one. They'll take Consequential. she will attack for three. And we'll stay up because we've got Nick Fury. Uh, we'll draw four cards. Ground Stomp, Combat Training, Smash the Problem, and a Quinn Carrier. One threat goes on the main. Rhino's going to attack. Nick is going to block. Two plus two, so four. Nick gets knocked out. 
get our encounter card. It's got a charge coming in. Okay, we'll use Avengers Mansion to draw a card. It's another ground stomp. We will Hmm. You will actually just spend three. Put in the Quinn carrier. Um, we'll then attack for three. Knocking Rhino into the next stage. Uh, so when revealed, we search for the break and take inside scheme and reveal it. There it is. It'll bring in the hazard icon, comes in with two threat. So you place one digital threat here per player, so it's going got three. Um, we will then thwart for two with Hellcat. And we'll thwart for one with Mockingbird to get rid of it. Mockingbird gets knocked out. And, oh, and Rhino should have eight, sorry, 15 health now. We'll throw away Smash the Problem and ready. We have four cards. We have a Drop Kick, Power of Aggression, Quick Strike, and Psylocke. Okay, we get one threat in the main. Rhino is going to attack us for six. We're going to take it. So six plus two, so eight. Taking us down to four, the charge goes away. Get our encounter card. Rhino heals four damage. If no damage is healed this way, you get surge. And we are confused. All right. All Avengers Mansion to draw a card. It's legal practice. Uh, we're going to use legal practice. Use legal practice. And power of aggression for a drop kick. We deal four damage to an enemy. If paid for any physical resources, we stun and draw a card. So Rhino goes down to 11. He gets stunned. We draw a card. Split personality. We will. Got that in place so we can do no we'll spend three so use the queen carrier quick strike and psylocke to play split personality change your form then drop to your printed hand size the printed hand size is six so professor x superhuman strength focused rage Another focus rage, drop kick, and superhuman law division. So we will Oh and now I kinda of wanna No, I don't even want to recover. Um, we're going to flip back up to She-Hulk, trigger our response, do even lift, because we can flip up because we were able to use split personality to flip down, so we haven't done our change this turn. Um, we're going to spend two resources to put in superhuman strength. And 
giving us plus two attack, so we're going to attack for five. You can write down the four. Um, after shield attacks, discard super strength, stun the attacked enemy. Now, because runner is not a valid target to stun, we can't trigger this, so it stays around. Um, we're probably just going to hold on to the. We might uh, we'll throw away Professor X. Actually, we'll throw away all of it. I don't think we need it. And we're ready. Keeping Hellcat around in case we need to block. Get four more cards. We have one, two punch, superhuman strength, martial prowess, and assault training. Get one threat on the main. Ryan is going to attack us, but he's stunned. Get our encounter card. The villain schemes. Schemes for one plus one is two. Taking them to five out of seven. But we can then just swing at him for five damage. Defeating Rhino. So, She Hulk, strongest one there is. Uh, but yeah, so there was our first, you know, foray into She Hulk. Um, just going solo against Rhino. Obviously, not a huge challenge, but you know, people talk about Rhino being swingy in solo because of his whole seven, seven threat threshold. But still, um, we just focus on the aggression, beat him down, wasn't such a big issue. Uh, so yeah, so I guess we'll see how she Hulk goes if we continue this on. Uh, Claw will be up next. So yeah, if you like this content, make sure you um, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.